This is Dr. Vickers with Texas Center for Oral Surgery and Dental Implants. I'd like to take a few minutes to talk you through our preoperative instructions for oral surgery. Generally speaking, it's best when you're preparing for oral surgery to come to the office in comfortable clothing. For me, this means short sleeve shirt or layers if it's cold outside so that you can get into a short sleeve shirt, and it means loose fitting baggy pants. Additionally, we'd like for you to wear tennis shoes if possible so that you can be most comfortable when walking after sedation. It's best if you avoid sandals or other slip on type of shoes as they tend to fall off while you're trying to walk. For all patients that are undergoing IV sedation, it's mandatory to have an adult with you who can give you a safe ride to surgery and home afterwards. We also ask that this person stay here in the office throughout the duration of your procedure. This ensures that when your surgery is done and you're ready to go, that your ride is here to help. Perhaps the most important instructions for any patient undergoing IV sedation for oral surgery is to avoid eating or drinking anything for six hours prior to surgery. If you're a smoker, we ask you to avoid smoking for at least 24 hours before surgery and 48 hours after surgery, if at all possible. Furthermore, we request that you not drink any alcohol for at least 24 hours prior to your surgery. Unless other arrangements were discussed at your consultation, we generally recommend you take your normal morning medications with a small sip of water. After your surgery, we'll keep you here in the office until you're safe to leave. But generally speaking, once you get home, you'll still need a little bit of time to fully recover from the effects of the anesthesia. As a reminder, these instructions will be given to you in writing at your consultation visit as well. And if there are any questions about them, please feel free to ask when you come in for your surgery.